What is going on, everybody? This is SDoc21, welcoming you to my YouTube channel. That's a pretty fancy intro you got right there, isn't it? Mm -hmm. What is going on, everybody? This is SDoc21, coming to you with more Minecraft Let's Play. And in today's episode, it is going to be the first special, which means this episode is going to be about 25 to 30 minutes long so that is super exciting let me get out of f5 here and as you can see we are in a different setting here uh, we have a bed now so that's always awesome but we're in a little dirt hole look at that guys everything has changed what happened well i am now on the snapshot the 1.8 snapshot and the reason why we are now here which is let's see about 900 blocks away from spawn is because I want all of the brand new blocks to generate. Is that a floating tree? Oh no, okay, it's attached to that one. Okay, anyway, I want all of the new blocks to generate. So diorite, uh, and I think it's andesite, and then granite. You can also craft slime blocks, and you can craft the fancy like jungle temple stone brick blocks. So that's pretty awesome. So anyway, I moved away so we can go ahead and get all of the fancy new blocks to actually generate underneath us because they're all rock blocks that generate. So that's super exciting. And while I was here, I did a little bit of capturing and breeding. So I now have three of the four yummy, yummy food items. Well, sheep you can't eat, but you get wool. So I mean, that's close enough. So anyway, this is going to be home of the porkers, but I don't have any carrots. Let's see. I have some shears here for the the sheep and I've been collecting some sugarcane and some wheat so yeah and I love this sugarcane because as you can see I am right here I'm in a roofed forest biome but now I'm in a plains biome so I have two different colored sugarcane I just think it looks pretty hilarious over there so anyway yes my home is actually now a plains biome and as you can see it's very flat here and not grassy like over there well why is that so because I took enough time to clear out this whole area and mow every little piece of grass. Yes. Yes, I did. Okay, so now, what is on the agenda since we are in a whole brand new place? I figured we might as well start off by building ourselves a nice place to store some stuff and how about a big house? I'm thinking a house over here and a chest storage place over here. Does that sound good? Yes, okay. So, I have been doing some harvesting. I have a ton of wood. Yes, a ton. It literally is a ton. So, let me just go ahead and take all of this. Ooh, I don't want the spruce wood. Go away, spruce wood. Where'd that go? There it is. Okay. Now, I do not know exactly what these buildings are going to look like, but I do know the dimensions that I want because I did work it out in creative before. So, let me go ahead and put my coordinates up here. Let me take a quick peek at my notes. All right, what block is this? 750, 49, 48, 47, 44, 47, and boop. All right, we are now starting our chest storage. Yeah, be excited, right? So this building is actually going to be rather large because why not, right? So this building is actually gonna be 19 by 13 by 5. So 19 length, 13 width, and then it's going to be 5 blocks high. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. I also apologize now in advance for any lag that happens, but because I am on the snapshot, it's going to be a little bit buggy because all of the stuff has to load in. Okay, so now we need a door in the center, right? What's the center? <laughs> I didn't even think about marking this out. I think this is the center right here. We're just going to we're just going to go with it. This this block is the center. So there we go. Need this around the door. I like the look of these logs. Yeah, that's centered. I like the look of the logs. I don't know. Maybe you don't, but I think it's pretty cool. And I do also like that you can change direction with these. But anyway, I need to... Oh, can I not build down there? Come on. There we go. I need to make this place for the door. 
So the door is going to go in here. So let me just collect this up. Now what I'm using here is dark oak because I like the color of it. It's very, very dark. It's very, very standoff in your face. Like, wah! You know what I mean? Maybe not? Okay. So anyway, back to counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Boop! Yes, I am only building it up three high for the time being. I'm not going to build it all the way up five high until I have the basic structure down. Is this in line here? Nope, one block off. That should be right. Yep. And three. So how am I going to set up this building? Well, I want to do it where it's kind of split in half, where I've got some storage over here for chests and then a place for like a crafting table and maybe an anvil. So, yeah, we're going to roll with that. Anyway, what am I going to use for the outside? Well, I don't want to use logs the whole time, so I should probably use some planks, right? Now, do I put logs on the bottom or not? That's the question, guys. Do I plank it like this on the bottom as well? Or do I use logs? That See, I didn't work any of that out. I just worked out the dimensions and where all of this is going to actually physically be. Hmm. Hmm. Let's go ahead and build this one over. Go ahead and finish up this side real fast. As I fail again, I did the same thing, I think, in the same block on the other side as well. So that's pretty spectacular. All right, do I want to go logs? Because I want to go logs on top, I think. Or maybe not. Maybe I don't want to do logs on top. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. I feel like the villagers. All right, one, two, three, and then four, right? Yeah. Just got to build this up as well. This is going to be like the front half of the, the room, the area, the stuff. There you go. <laughs> so this is just going to be kind of a chill little little building episode, I guess, before we get into all of the other fun stuff, because there are tons of new blocks that I want to get my hands on, which are all underground. Let me swallow my spit. Did I want it this way? Three, four, five, hold on. One, two, yeah, that's right. That is right, okay. And then we need some posts here. That way our building can be correctly constructed. Oh, another physical change. Actually, I don't want these posts here. Another physical change is that I now have a mouse pad. So whenever I pick up my mouse and set it down, I think you can hear that, but it won't be a huge clacking sound like it used to be. So I apologize for that in the past. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna plank this off on the bottom. That way it gives more of a contrast with the outside, the, uh, the supports. So I think that's gonna be pretty sweet. Also on the agenda are a bunch of things that I left back at the old place. You know, getting diamonds, finding a village, doing enchanting and all of that fun stuff. Let's take a gander here. So, yep, it's looking pretty nice, isn't it? I like it. I like it a lot, a lot, a lot. All right, so it's coming up on nighttime, so I might as well sleep here. And then I will snag some dirt for some scaffolding. And this is really laggy. What are my FPS right now? I don't even know. It's probably like 13 or 14. 12. Yeah, okay. That's really low, because normally I'm at like 50. And I am using Optifine, for those of you who are wondering. Let me take this stack of dirt here, put the planks up there. No, I didn't mean to put it back in there. Whoops. All right, dirt. Okay. Oh, goodness. This is just this is just one of those days, guys. I'm going to go off on a little bit of a tangent here. I've just been having such a crappy time, especially with work. It's not that it's bad or anything. It's just really been bugging me. Oops. Didn't, didn't want to do that. They're just asking a whole lot for me, and it kind of ticks me off. Anyway, I guess that's just my little tangent there. I I saw something on fire. All right, anyway, back to the build. So this is going to be five tall, and the reason for that is because of where I'm putting the crafting bench and anvil. It'll give me enough headroom clearance, so because they're going to be up a level, not like a whole level or anything like that, but they're going to be up one block. Hurrah! There we go. All right, now, do I like that? Hmm. Hmm. I don't really like that, guys. Maybe I should just f 
switch the two. All right, we're going to switch the two. I know, I just built all this pretty scaffolding, and now I have to build around it anyway. All right, yeah, we're going to make the top row the logs. Oh, this is going to take forever, so have fun watching me do all of this. So anyway, guys, I guess we're about, what, 10 minutes here into the video, so about halfway through. Hopefully I can get a little bit more progress done. I know I wasn't exactly the best prepared for this, but it's just because I didn't really want to get everything all figured out because that kind of takes away all of the fun of building. So this will be really awesome when it's actually done. I'll have a place to store all of my items, and I'll be able to make a pretty gigantic house. My house is actually going to be huge. I almost fell off of here like twice. <laughs> all right, let's knock this down. Going to put in the logs. Perfect. Looking good. Looking sharp. Boop. And then I'll pick up that plank there from the ground. And these planks here, too. All right, let's take a step back and check it out. That's that's looking better. That's looking better. These need to be changed here. That one and that one. These need to be logs. And I don't know what to do with that one. I guess it would make sense just to turn that into a log. We'll probably put like a window here or something like that. See, that just looks really tall to me. That just looks kind of weird now. Hmm. Hmm. Huh. Huh. I'm a villager today. What do I want to do with that? <laughs> huh. I don't know. I guess we'll leave it. We'll leave it for now. All right, so let's go ahead and fill in these walls here so I can kind of explain this whole up a level. Oop. And actually, at this point, I need my birch. I didn't get much birch because I don't think I'm actually going to need much of it for the build, but if I do need more, I can always go and collect some. So let's go ahead and put this dirt in there as I accidentally shift-clicked again. And we will craft that up. Because it's a lighter wood, I think it'll be nice for flooring in here. What I want to do, though, is I want to do like this. And then you can put something here in the middle. See what I mean? right here in the middle, and you have one space walking? Or should I do two space walking? So if I do that, I'm gonna have to, oops, I'm gonna have to move some, some wood. Yeah, I think we should do two spaces to walk around. I think that'll look much better, Le a lot less crowded. So, oops, I did, whoa, okay, that was, that was a little laggy there. It just doubles, ooh, double place that for me. All right, is that two? Yeah, that's two on each side. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And then we just do like this. See, it's up a level, and then we need to... Oh, I don't even have a crafting bench. I didn't even think about bringing a crafting bench. What am I doing, guys? I am just... I am out of it today, to be completely honest. I don't think I'm going to need this many slabs, but might as well take them. Let's go ahead and put that oak back so I can get in these slabs. But that way, it's, it's like a little built-in step. So I think it'll look nice, right? Obviously, these floors won't be dirt. It'll be changed out eventually, which means these need to move. These pillars needs to move. Do I do it on the outside? No, I need to do it here in the middle. Two, three. There we go. And then we'll have chests, one, two, three space, and then chests again. Looks good. Looks good. Oh, I don't want to use a birch. I was about to fill that all in with birch. That would have been fun to take all down. Hurrah. Jumping. Got him. Just filling in this second row here, and I guess apparently the third row. There we go. Come on. Ah, there we go. Ta -da! And now we have kind of a skeleton of the building, so that's pretty exciting. But anyway, why do I want to make something so massive? Well, to be completely honest, I saw something similar on someone else's channel where they had a nice storage space for all of their chests, and they had a, a like, I think it was, I think there actually was a crafting bench and an anvil up in the front. I'm doing my building a little bit different than theirs, but anyway, the person who I saw doing this was actually KYR Speedy on his first season of Crewcraft, because that's what I watch. I like watching them. They're pretty funny. Anyway. Anyway. <laughs> I, I enjoy their stuff, but 
I saw it on there and I thought, you know what, that looks pretty sharp. I, I like that. I want to do something like that. So that's why I'm doing something similar. I'm not taking his design. I believe his design was actually much different than mine. But he had a bunch of chests in the back and he had his crafting bench and anvil and all of that. So I thought it was pretty cool. And I figured I would do something similar because it makes sense. It uses up the space very nicely instead of you just having random chests all over the place. All right, so let's get out this birch again, so I can fill this in. Ah, stupid birch. Yeah, I like that. I like the birch. It looks good. How many wide is that? Is that five wide? No, that's four wide. All right, and then we got to put the slabs. Ta-da. So then when you walk in here, you'll be greeted with some cool stuff here. I also want to put in walls here, but I want to do it so it's three wide, right? Yes. Oops, that's not what I want to do. I should have been on top. Okay, that's definitely not what I want to do. Okay, S-Stock is misclicking for days today. Holy cow, guys. Is it time for bed yet? Right, get rid of the birch. That's not going to be a wall. We need to fill this in with some oak. Some good old classic oak wood yes 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 that's again failed twice all right will someone come over here and like tell me how to minecraft because i'm doing terrible with this clicking stuff today i guess it would make sense to do <sighs> okay guys i got it we're good we're good we're, we're chill we're chill yeah I'd do that and then yeah then the wood on top I just, I think it looks really weird out there from the front. Maybe just because it is so tall, I think I should probably frame it on the bottom, at least on the front. I don't like these being logs. Those, those look dumb. So if you were yelling at me in the first part of the video, you're welcome. It's fixed. So much better. So much better. Should I frame with logs on the bottom? I think I need to. Yeah, we're going to do it. We're going to frame with the logs. It, it, it just, it, it's so much just regular old wood, you know what I mean? If you don't know what I mean, it's just, it's just too much, it's too bland. Even though I'm going to be using the same blocks as the other part of the building. But, you, you get what I'm saying, right? Oh my goodness! I'm about to just, I'm about to quit, guys. I'm about to quit Minecraft. Forever. See, that looks so much better already. And then we'll put in windows. Windows are to come later. I'll figure out the windows. I don't know. Maybe I'll do it in creative and figure it out, or I can just uh, YOLO swag it here in the game. <laughs> That's right, YOLO swag it. For all of you guys that hate that phrase, you're welcome. That's kind of how I like to build. Without a plan, you just go ahead and do it. That looked really weird. Was something floating over here? Huh. I must have just had a lapse of frames there. It means I should probably frame the rest of the bottom out with logs as well. Well, that way it, it is symmetrical. It, it is? Oh my goodness, I'm not even speaking English well today. I am just drained, to be completely honest. I was walking back from work because I work here on campus. I don't live that far. You know, I, I live maybe like a, a three or four minute walk away from where I work, so you know, it's not that big of a deal. But anyway, I was walking back from work and I got so lightheaded that I actually almost fell over and I'm kind of scared. I don't know why. I get lightheaded a lot because I really I have really low blood pressure to begin with, and that's a main reason why. But I I was like literally about to fall over, and I don't know. It just something wasn't right, and I don't know what it's from, or why it would have spiked out of nowhere. So that's probably why I'm a little bit off today in the recording. But I promise I will try to do my best to fix that for next time. So I don't sound and look like a complete and total idiot. Anyways, we are just going to put in these logs here real fast and not get crept up by a creeper. That's right, crept up by a creeper. Ooh, I hear cave noises. That's good. I love them cave noises. All right, that zombie saw me. That's wearing all gold armor. So let's get out of here. Let's get over here to my nice little hole in the ground where I got my bed. And while we sleep, I'm going to take a drink. Fresh water. It's always good for the body, right? 
See, I like that. That that just that looks impressive. Now let's go kick the crap out this creeper and hope he doesn't blow up this beautiful terrain that I shaped by freaking hand for hours. Go away. Go away. No, 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 no. Third hit. Yeah, there we go. All right, so let's get back to framing in over here. Five, and I guess I'll leave this wall open while I construct. Red. Oh, see, something's floating over here. Boop. All right, and then that was for three wide, right? So there. Yep. Point fixed. Two, three. And let's go ahead and oak this up. But you see what I mean? So there's going to be a nice little separation between the chests. Okay, that one wasn't even me. That was a double click. I don't know what happened there. Actually, let me check here. No. Okay, well, it wasn't my trackpad then because I thought I turned that off. I don't know. Eh. Fail jump because I'm lagging. There we go. Yeah, but see, it'll be like two little rooms here, and then there'll be chest rooms back here. So I think that's going to look pretty awesome. So let's go ahead and dark oak the last two here. And then we can throw down some planks on this side. Right? Yeah. Yeah, it's all symmetrical. Okay. <laughs> I'm just checking, guys. I, I can be a little anal retentive about being symmetrical, especially in Minecraft, because it is a game about blocks where they are completely symmetrical, so yeah. If that bugs you, I'm sorry. I don't do well with that whole make it look natural thing. No. It's gonna be it's gonna be done the right way. It's gonna look perfect. And then I am gonna do a roof on these buildings. I don't know what I'm doing for the roof yet. I'm not sure if I want to like do something super impressive or just like a regular old stair type roof or just flat roof it off. I, I don't really know. That's gonna be figured out in another episode. Let's go ahead and jump up y'all. Get that place down. Oh, am I in its way? Yeah. Two. And then get these done here. All right, so the front half of the building is done. Back half is almost done. Let's go ahead and bring another dark oak into here. Now, I don't know what I want to do for this doorway here. If I should just do like that and make it just too tall, or if I should put another one, or if I should just like beam it off on the top. Let's just, let's just try the beam first. I could do like that. I think putting beams in here would be pretty sweet looking. There we go. I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot, a lot. Yeah! I like that. I like how it's all, all beamy and stuff. And I guess it'll make sense if it's nice and wide open like that, right? Holy lag, though. Do I need to put a cross beam here? No, I think that's too many beams, to be honest, on that one. So let's just go ahead and take that one down, and then I'll get to finishing the back of the house. And then maybe, maybe, guys, in next episode, we can start building the house. Yeah. Sounds like a plan, doesn't it? All right, let's go ahead and get that in there, and there, and there. All right, we are on the top floor. I don't want to fall down. I worked so hard to get here. There we go. And then that. Oh, geez. Okay, I can't do it on top. Okay. Let me eat the pork chop here. Oh, yeah, that's another thing. When I went and was on my journey from the old spawn over... Do I have any more oak left? I do. All right, so anyway, I journeyed over here. I just actually picked this spot at random because I liked the dark oak because I figured it would be pretty good for builds. And I don't know. I like it because it's kind of dangerous because of the darkness level in the forest. It spawns in a lot of creepy crawly bad guys stuff, so I like that. But anyway... I went and could not get everything the first time, so I went back the second time and actually got everything, and then as I was passing back, I knew I was out of food, because at that point I only had like two or three chickens and maybe like one cow. So I went and I killed as many pigs as possible. So that's why I have so many pork chops, but don't have any pigs. All right, I think this needs a beam here in the middle. Can I reach it? Oh, Minecraft gods, why do you hate me? There's my dirt. I was going to say, I got dirt around here somewhere. 
now I can reach it. Yep. Can I reach that one from here? Nope. Alright, now let's just get rid of this dirt. Put that there. Actually, that, that was smart. Why don't I just do like this? And just build this way. Ta-da! Alright, perfect! Ouch. And then right in here would be where our chests go. I think I'm going to do three high, one chest, two chest, three chest, maybe? And then put like the start of the roof here or something like that so you don't see all of this stuff in the middle. You just see like the beams if I'm going to do a staircase. So yeah, I think that looks pretty fantastic, guys. It does. Do I need to make these out of oak? Or the dark oak? Hmm. Huh. I think I probably should just so it matches because that's a lot of regular old oak wood. So let's go ahead and cap off these walls here. I also make it more symmetrical, which I like. I like symmetrical. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, right? Six, five, I don't know. Math is, there's three types of people in this world. Those that can do math and those that can't. Did you figure out the joke yet? Do you need me to help or, or you got, oh, you got it? You got it? Okay, okay, good, good. I'm glad you got it. All right, so let's go ahead and snag this. We're gonna head over here to my hole, turn around, and there we go. That looks amazing, actually. I'm really proud of myself. That looks good. So yeah, I guess we might as well cap off the episode here while looking at all of my fancy animals, guys. Have a great day, everybody, and I will see you all next time. All right, guys, click the video on the left to take you to the previous video. Click my speed drawing of a 3D question mark on the right to take you to a random video. And as always, be sure to hit the big red button down below to subscribe.